So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add animated icons like this into Notion. So here's a couple more examples. As you can see, these icons here are animated. I'll just click on the reading list. So here is one of our animated icons. And here is another example. So the first thing I'm going to do is just add a new page. So let's say this is our movie list. So to add animated icons, you'll need to head over to this website, giphy.com. So Notion themselves don't have animated icons, but we can add them using this website. So once you're on this website, you just want to type in something related to the topic. So in this case, it's a movie list. So I'm just going to type in movie and hit enter. So that's then going to bring up a range of different GIFs. Um, but what you're going to want to do is instead of GIFs, we're going to click on this stickers icon. So this will then bring up a range of different stickers. So the difference between the GIFs and the stickers is the stickers have a clear background. So they look a lot better as icons compared to the GIFs. You can still embed the GIFs, but I would recommend the stickers option. So then what you'll want to do is just scroll through and choose one that you like. I think I'm going to go with this one. So when you've selected one, just hover over it and you'll see this little link icon appear. So if you just click on that little link, it will copy the link to your clipboard. Next, you want to head back over to Notion. And if you just hover above, you can see this add icon button. So you want to click on that. Next, we want to click on this custom button and it will ask you to paste in a link. So you want to paste in the link that we just copied and click submit. And if you just give it a second, it will load your animated sticker. So there we are. That is an animated icon. So this icon will be animated anywhere that you link to that page. So as you can see here, these icons are all animated. Okay, so I'll just do one more example. So in this case, let's say it's a reading tracker. I'm just going to head back over to this website and this time I'll type in book. So as I said, you can use the GIFs as well as the stickers. They will physically embed. They just don't quite look as good as the stickers because they don't have a clear background. But I will just show you what one looks like. So let's just go with this one. So back on this page, I'm just going to click add icon, click on custom and paste in the link to the GIF. So here is this what it looks like as a GIF. So feel free to go for this option if you like. You can also add a cover photo. I'm just going to change the cover. So this is what it would look like if you had the cover photo with one of the GIFs. I'll just quickly show you what it would look like with a sticker rather than the GIF. So back on this website, if I click on stickers, there are many different options to choose from. I'm going to try this one. And to change the icon, if I just click here, I can add in a different one. So this is a different option for the reading tracker. So as I say, it's completely up to you on what you prefer. And that's it. That's how you can add animated icons into Notion. If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe. And you can also check out my pre-made Notion templates on my Etsy store. The link will be in the description box below.